Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and being true to our word, um, there's been a comment question about um, sys argv. What is it? How does it work? Um, just we need to we need to look at it. So all right, let's just let's just jump to it. So import sys. So, all right, help sys.argv. Oops, helps if you type everything right. So, all right, we're not going to get a lot from this, but we're going to look at it. So, all right, it is a list object. So, all right, all it is now, this is super important. We need to pull this up. If you do not know how to do this, guess what? There is a video of how to get to your command line. That's what I just did. So, all right. The name of my Python file right here is ideas.py. So, we'll look at that in a second. So, we're just going to do this for item in sys arg v print item we're going to do this and we're going to go slow we're going to save it we're not going to run it because it is a command line file so all right ideas dot py then um what is this okay I want you to look real close. What is this came out? All right. So, and also let's do let's do this one more way. Print system v. All right. Save. This is what I love about command line. You just hit up, do it again. Oops. Okay. Ah. Uh, okay. Well, actually, let's talk about what we did with this for loop. Let's get rid of this. Let's move this. Move it down here. Well, let's just talk about this. So I did printed the whole list. Then I printed what whole list again is whole list again this save it run it do it again so I want you to look really 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 close all this variable is this isn't even a function or a method this is literally a value it is and that's and that's it and it's an object and it it is a list it takes in the let's look at it this way just think about our index four but this is what I want you to look at look real real close I know this is harder in DOS but bracket, this is the first item that we typed in because I typed in the file name. So it drops that in my path because we have that in path. So this is my zero index. Then so zero, one, two, three. Zero, one, two, three. <coughs> Excuse me. So don't overthink this. This is the same as a just a regular list object. It just takes an input from the user on the command line. And this is how you, this is the tool that Python has already created for you of how to interact with the user on the command line. So whatever gets typed in, then you can go and pull it and do whatever you need to with it. So there we go. Hope that was very helpful. 
just a real quick video on this so absolutely awesome question really appreciate it um, Hope this was helpful for anybody else, but that is what we do here. If you have a question, please ask. More than likely, somebody else has that same question, so you're not just helping us out, you're helping out a ton of other people. So as always, thank you very much. If this is the type of video you like, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And uh, if you're new here and you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and most important, the notification bell because we have awesome videos like this coming out all the time and um, especially like this that we need to look at something a little bit more in depth, a little bit, uh, uh, just a little bit more. So as always, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. We'll see you next time. Bye guys.